in a very unusual move, the state of West Virginia, has just sent one Supreme Court justice packing and seems poised to do the same for the rest of the justices. The West Virginia House Judiciary Committee approved 14 articles of impeachment against the four sitting justices of the West Virginia Supreme Court of Appeals on Tuesday. The eighth day of the committee's meetings regarding possible impeachment produced the first material results when 14 articles of impeachment were introduced at 9.25 a.m. By the time the committee adjourned at 6.15 p.m., its members had added two new articles to their draft and rejected two of the original proposed articles, advancing the possibility of impeachment for the majority of the elected officials in the Mountain State's judicial branch of government. It's a sad day, and it certainly isn't a cause for celebration, Judiciary Chairman John Schott, a Mercer, said Tuesday as the articles were distributed to the 24 committee members present in the House chamber. Those articles will now advance to the full House of Delegates for consideration. Speaker pro tempore John Overington, a Berkeley, said Tuesday he called for the House to reconvene at 10 a.m. Monday. The articles serve as formal charges or accusations that the justices committed one of the impeachable offenses listed in Section 9. Article 4 of the West Virginia Constitution. The articles of impeachment charge Chief Justice Margaret Workman and Justices Robin Davis, Alan Larry and Beth Walker with maladministration, corruption, incompetency, neglect of duty and certain high crimes. In total, Lowry is the subject of eight articles of impeachment. Workman and Davis each are the subject of four and Walker is the subject of two. Former Justice Menace Ketchum was not a subject of impeachment because he resigned from the bench last month. Some of the articles charge more than one justice at a time with a given impeachable offense. Each justice is charged with unnecessary and lavish spending of state taxpayer dollars to renovate their offices in the east wing of the Capitol. All four of them also are charged with failing to develop and maintain court policies regarding the use of state resources, including cars, computers and funds in general. Lowry faces additional charges related to his alleged use of state vehicles for personal travel, having state furniture and computers in his home, having personal photos, documents, photos and artwork framed on the state's dime and handing down an administrative order authorizing payments of senior status judges in excess of what is allowable in state law. Davies and Workman are charged with signing documents authorizing that senior status judges be paid in excess of what's allowable in state law. One article against Walker, charging her with using state money to pay an outside attorney to author an opinion in 2017, was rejected by the committee in a 14-9 vote. The outside attorney in that matter was Barbara Allen, currently the interim Supreme Court Administrator, who wasn't employed with the court at the time she wrote the opinion, said Marsha Kaufman, attorney for the Judiciary Committee. The committee also rejected an article against workmen that charged her with facilitating the hiring of a contracted employee to do IT work for the court as a political favor. While unusual, maybe the state's legislature is on to something. Any government official that abuses their position, or taxpayer dollars, should be sent packing. Thanks for watching. What did you think of this video? Let us know in the comments section below. You can also subscribe for more videos like these in your inbox. Now if you are seeking the latest trends in fashion, and electronics and gifts and more of the coolest things that you never knew existed at the best prices, please feel free to visit www.atthesmall.com once again that is www.atthesmall.com Com. If you are seeking the best in facial and clear skin regiments and products for women and men including an opportunity to earn residual income, please visit our partner at www.jdro.myrnf.com, all links are in the description box below. Share this video with your friends and family. Since you're watching, we have a small favor to ask. More people are viewing our videos more than ever but advertising revenues across the media are falling fast. And unlike many news organizations, we haven't put up a paywall, we want to keep our journalism as open as we can. So you can see why we need to ask for your help. Our videos and reports takes a lot of time money and hard work to produce. Our investigative reporting uncovers unethical behavior and social injustice, that helps to hold governments, companies and individuals to account. Through this we can, together, create meaningful change in the world. We do it because we believe our perspective matters, because it might well be your perspective too. For as little as one dollar, you can support us, 
and it only takes a minute. Thank you. Like and share this video on Facebook and Twitter if you agree. Don't forget to support this channel by clicking on the donation link down below and subscribing so you never miss any of our trending reports. What do you think about this video? Scroll down to comment below. Now if you are seeking the truth or guidance or need a prayer request or studies, please visit followyeshva.com at www.follow. Y. E. S. H. U. A. Now.com Please note that we have changed to a new YouTube channel, the link is in the description box below, please subscribe to the new channel, as this one will no longer have new videos and reports posted to it anymore.